Let's see what the first one shall be. Ivan, Ivana, bitch. Ivanka, bitch. Ivana, bitch. Ivana, bitch. We got flavored vodka. Seventy proof peach. I mean, I like peaches and I like vodka. Peach. Ooh. I don't like peach stuff. Yeah. Really peachy. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Very yeah. peachy. Yeah. Oh, that's not bad. I like it. Oh wow, it does smell really good. And it says peach. Oh man. Uh, no. It's such a cheap fucking bottle. Like this is gonna be some nasty ass <clears throat> shit. It, it looks like like cheap and and good, you know. Okay. Oh. Um, That's like stuck in my retainer. I wouldn't drink this ever again, to be honest with you. <laughs> that was mm, good. Yeah, that was, went really smooth. That was I mean, good. <laughs> it's good, but. <laughs> Makes my saliva thick though. Saliva? <laughs> oh, that was good. It's like a punch. Yeah, you can really taste the peach. Like that one tastes like peach mm -hmm. and ethanol. It's not really that. Well, it's okay. So you know, sometimes like the vodkas at the end, you know, they burn for 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 vodka. Yeah, it, it does got like a little burning, but not as much. <laughs> I can't speak. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Yes. Yes. Handcrafted in the United States, distilled from wheat and raisins. Handmade vodka. What it's, makes it handmade? Let me see. I'm what? Raisins. It's from Austin. Raisins? Raisins. Eric Clark Jr. is from Austin. Where does it say that? Raisins. Tito's. <laughs> Tito's. Oh yeah. Wheat and raisins. Handcrafted in the United States, but distilled from wheat and oh raisins. <laughs> That's in <laughs> Russia. <laughs> what else is from Austin? I really like this one. Because it says it's made in Texas. I do like how uh, it's the color. And if it's made in Texas, then I automatically like it. What's 40%? Even if it doesn't taste good. Finished with pure mineral water, polished by coconut shells. Polished? What the fuck? Kind of smells like regular vodka with like just a splash of marshmallows. Ooh. That's how it smell. This one has more of that like. Uh. <laughs> I can get the party started with this, but it won't do the complete job, you know? <laughs> All right. Oh, ready? Yeah. Yeah. Just Are you thinking about it? This, you know, like, yeah, get it. Dash through this. No. <laughs> this is awkward, dude, because I'm on like. <coughs> I get. <it. laughs> huh. I wasn't too bad. I don't taste anything. That actually doesn't taste like anything. No, the aftertaste is really the umami taste, you know? Like, that's what it's called. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's not my favorite Austin vodka. Not even cool. No. I wouldn't say this isn't even my favorite vodka. I mean, obviously. Five. No reason at all. No reason flavor. I can't, I, I really didn't taste anything. I'm, uh, I'm a bit disappointed. Yeah. Have you taken a shot yet? Mm -mm. Bitch, you made me take the shot by myself? Mm -hmm. It's not bad, but it's not good, you know? Yeah. Sort of like... That's fucked up. The last one, too. I taste it, so I can actually get the taste. It's like comparing, I don't know. It ain't no Peter Piper pizza, it's more of a CC's. You don't savor it. There's a thing between savoring and tasting. But this, definitely, I would give it maybe ranking out of 10. Just like swallowing them, you do not even... Yeah, you get a taste because every now and then it hit. I want to say a six, seven. Seven at highest. But you don't get a savory. You don't get a taste. You don't actually. Yeah. On a good day. The emotion that the chef prepared in that. On a bad day, like a six. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Sometimes when you savor it, you get more than just a taste. No, a seven. Yeah. Because it's made in Texas. You get an experience. It tasted like straight up vodka. We got Sky Vodka. Sky! Sky. I've always wondered what this is. Like. Oh, we'll do it again. Okay. Terrible. We got Sky Vodka. Sky Vodka! I have. <laughs> it reminds me of something that you could find like in a hair salon. Damn, dude, chill with that shit. Bro, you act like I'm being unfair. <laughs> Did they put too much? 
And it's 40%. I don't know, I don't care. The meniscus, I need to look at the meniscus. And the bottle's really cool. The meniscus, <laughs> isn't that like a part of the body? Not like... No, no, no. Yeah, it's like a cool, like... <laughs> <laughs> like uh, the curve, you know, the liquid. Are you sure? <laughs> now you're making me doubt myself. Uh, I'm just asking. <laughs> Oh, this smells like it's gonna suck. Have a ah, this one does have more of that like mm. unappealing smell. Honestly, what do you want? It's a translucent blue bottle. It oh, like I like the same color as Vic. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Let's see how this one is. No taste whatsoever. Generic vodka. No, I do not like that one. Okay. 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 Oh yeah, this one. I will not take this one, like, again. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? How do you want me to explain that? If I, if I were to like paint a picture, I'll be like, just imagine you're walking down a metal. It tastes like any other generic vodka that you've ever had. No taste. It tastes like rubbing alcohol. Then, you know, you feel like a raindrop. Right? And you feel, oh, it's gonna rain. <laughs> Wait, this is a how are you describing a painting? <laughs> but it's like moving. <laughs> wow. So you mean like a video? Moving a picture. Movie? I'm, <laughs> so I'm moving. Okay, there it is. It tastes... Oh, that aftertaste. Oh, uh, that, that one tastes nasty. <laughs> Anyways, you're going okay, down the... Mr. 1920s. I, it has no like unique taste or anything it tasted pretty gross well anyways you know like <laughs> lightning starts hitting then a random bull hits you you know that's, <laughs> that's how and it that's feels the sky? <laughs> like yeah. the bull is the sky vodka hennessy i've heard of this Me i've too. seen people drink it i've never had it 40 percent alcohol there's no like marketed flavor on the bottle so i guess it's just cognic Cog taste cognic Cognac? It just Cognac? tastes like cog. I don't know. I don't even know how to say that. Cognac? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why do you like smelling? Cognac? 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 Cognac. I'm not looking like, forward to this one. Cognac. 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 C K. Cognac. Coney. <laughs> Coney. Kodiak. Kodak Black. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I fucked up your white little cloth, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty excited, but this is gonna, uh, this is gonna be a gag. It just, it, it went too far. It... I can't. I guess we're killing it. I guess we're killing it. All right. Yeah, let's do it. Are you sure? <laughs> I'm really not looking forward to this one. All right. Okay, cool. Never mind. It just tastes like honey though. I mean, obviously. <laughs> Wasn't too bad. You mean honey? That's what I meant. That's not bad. No, it is. Yeah, honey. I taste some honey in it. I didn't like it. That aftertaste. Sipping on it right now, it does take like a Jolly Rancher. I don't know which Jolly Rancher. Listen to me though. Right now I have the urge to just like, I swear I could get that Jolly Rancher. Maybe the grape fight. Like, drop it like it's hot, you know? I think I 101% disagree with you. But, good thing I can contain myself. I mean, it tasted how it... It it gets the job done. Just that taste. Pretty good, actually. Very good. You wanna fight? <laughs> yeah, maybe. It boils your blood. Maybe. Yeah, it does. It's nice knowing you, man. Alright. Be nice knowing you. Alright. You take care. Bye. Just end it like that. <laughs>